Most people love being surrounded by nature, relaxing, reading a book in the shade of a tree, letting their kids run free with grass under their bare feet. This is not the story of Rashid alone. It is the story of 37 million smallholder farmers in Tanzania, including myself. Three years ago, these two guys asked me to create a recipe, a recipe with crickets. I thought they were completely crazy. Insects are gross. But since then, I changed my mind, and tonight, I will convince you to eat crickets. Uganda is the size of Britain. But it consumes more charcoal than the whole of the European Union countries combined. While I'm standing here and speaking with you for five minutes, the world has already lost 20 hectares of forests. And during my two months staying in this Italian beautiful town of Padova, the world has lost 1.2 million hectares of forests. By the way, this is the size of my home country of Georgia. We created what we affectionately call the simpler solution. How simple, you ask? As easy as using water to grow plants. 400 ancient trees from its famous and biggest park, Casa del Campo, were blown down by an enormous storm. Because of the damages and the high age of the trees, the city thought the only use for them was, again, firewood. But there is another way for all of these wood leftovers the Sintala way. To date, we are working with 317 farmers, out of which 90% of these farmers are women. We've been able to increase the revenue of our, of our farmers from just under 2 euro per day to 7 euro per day. And 7 euro is the middle income class in Tanzania.